I'm Adam. And I'm Black Cat Bill. We're Dropout Kings. And you're watching No Cover TV. Know what it is, baby. We are here backstage at the Summit Festival. No Cover Magazine coming at you. Where to go, who to know, and we're with the Drop Out, Out Kings. Kings. You Drop know Out what Kings. it is. D.O.K. in the building, Glitch Gang. What's up? This, is, this has been a lot of fun. I've been talking to these guys a little bit before we started this interview. I feel like we're kindred brothers, kindred yeah. souls already. We've got a lot, a lot of cool things in common. Uh, I'm going to give you guys the mic. I want to introduce Adam and then Bill, both singers in the band. They, uh, they started off in Phoenix, Arizona, right? You guys were Phoenix down. Facts. And then you decided to change your name, yeah. which I think is great because you kind of manifested where you are now, right? So you're part of Suburban Noise Records mm -hmm. with means. the Cottonmouth Kings, Spade Life, uh, right here, Spade Life. <laughs> and, and it's like the king, the crown, everything the singer does. It's like it's all there, but now he has on his label the Dropout Kings. How perfect is that for him? Yeah, no, it is kind of crazy. It's been nice, you know what I'm saying? We definitely feel like we fit in with the style and the style and everything that Zinger's been developing. And right from Happy E to Cottonmouth Kings, we're just like, hey, we're the next step, the next branch of that. Big, trying to take it to the future, man. Big time. I mean, we gave Cottonmouth Kings uh, their first cover of the magazine. We gave Head PE their first cover of the magazine. Maybe, who knows, Dropout Kings. Have you guys had a cover? Yeah, one time. Oh, well, yeah, that that's it. It's done. <laughs> hey, hey, shut it down. That's me. it. Shit, it <laughs> we only do the first, man. We only do the first. <laughs> All right, so actually, no, I lied. <laughs> we did. <laughs> well, I'll, 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 I know how to find that. So this is exciting. You guys are out. Like I said, you guys sound a lot very similar. You fit right in with that with the uh, label. Head PE, we love those guys. Cottonmouth Kings, we love those guys. It's got to be exciting going from starting off with Napalm. Yeah, yeah, Napalm. Um, you know what I'm saying? That was the first level where we were signed on, which is obviously overseas based out of, you know, Europe and stuff. So, Did a lot of European tours? Uh, we just, just got first. back from our first one. Yeah. So absolutely lit, man. Awesome. Um, Where'd you guys go? We went to a lot of different, we went to the UK, the Netherlands, Austria, Germany. Uh, we went to, yeah, that's all I can really think Czech of. Republic. Off Czech Republic, yeah, that was another one. Love Italy, yeah, was Prague, Italy. did you play Prague? Prague, yeah, pretty much, it's like, wasn't technically Prague, but essentially, yeah. 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 Great, Skip great. Skip the jump again. Great, great metal scene out there. Oh, God, yeah. You guys jump on any festivals? Any yeah, yeah. Big we played one called Fight Fest in Czech Republic, and then we played uh, Full Force Festival in Germany. Very cool. Very cool. Yeah, That's awesome. Lit. So now you guys are on Suburban Noise. You're, everything's happening for you. You're on this tour. You're starting off. This is the first show on the tour? Uh, no, this is probably like the fourth. Something. Yeah, fourth. fourth. It's not bad. You're, you're no. at Summit Fest, right? Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. Shoot, kicking it off well. Yeah, you know? kick, kicking I'd it off say. well. <laughs> so how how many uh, shows do you have on this tour? Um, it's about uh, what like five weeks a yeah. month, five weeks long. So probably like twenty something. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean, mid twenties. So I gotta ask, what have you learned about each other while being stuck in a van? Dude, honestly, like we can really get through anything. Like we've been through the worst of things, the best of things, and it's just like uh, you uncover more and more things every day about each other, but. I mean, we're all like super good friends at the end of the day, you know, like we'll have our moments where someone gets on someone's nerves, but like whatever, like it always gets squashed and, you know. Cool. Yeah, you know, it's just like being with your, with, uh, in the, when you're with your brothers and you're all stuck in a room, Yeah. yeah. you know what I'm saying? Cause there's five of y'all, but there's just a two bedroom house or whatever. So right. it's like the same yeah. thing. Like we, we all on top of each other and in the way and stuff, but. Everybody's an adult, so we make sure to we find ways to get our own little space when we need it and yeah, do our give and each do other thing a little and be honest. Yeah, yeah, you know what I mean. So we make it work, but we have a blast. We definitely piggyback off each other's energy and just. So from so it. from here, where do you guys go next? Uh, we go to Indiana next. Indiana. Okay. Yeah. 
I was like, <laughs> hoping that was it, because I answered that question like four times before earlier today yeah. to fans, and I was like, Indiana. Yeah. Just get in the van and go. We'll yeah. say yeah. <laughs> at some like, point. Our van, overheated on, our van overheated on the way here today, and uh, we got to drive tonight while there's no traffic, and then get to the next place, get our radiator fixed, or actually just get a whole new one, and then we'll slap it in there. But yeah, just run wow. it and gunning, bro. Wow. Yeah. Run it and gunning. That's life on the road. It is. That is so road, life man. on the road. Yeah. So you guys got a single, I heard. You said you're le releasing a song or a single or? Oh, so yeah. our first single, Hey Uh, is out right Great now video. off of our new album. Fun Thank video. you. Thank yeah. you. So. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate that. The new album uh, is called Riot Music. You know what I'm saying? So that's coming up. Yeah, we don't yeah. got a release date yet, but it's it's in the process, like, you know, very close to getting to that point. So we're definitely super excited about the new music and the work coming out. We'll probably, you know, maybe throw out another track or two before, you know, we get the album out there. But either way, just know that we got some new things coming to follow up. Hey, uh, and they're also really dope and high energy and just Cool. some new styles that people haven't heard from us yet so we're very, excited very cool well what do you guys think if it's his first time out in ohio in cleveland area no we've been out here a, a bunch actually but uh first time at this spot okay. this spot's really cool though cool. yeah chris chris puts it down yeah, i know you guys have a relationship with chris before yeah, right yeah he actually uh he, he managed my old band the bad chapter and that's how i met him and then uh he was our first manager for a while, and was then that CB Entertainment or Mercenary. CB Entertainment. Okay. Yeah, I think Mercenary. I think he was on the tail end of Mercenary when I met him. Okay. And then he started CB Entertainment. Doesn't, doesn't hurt to know all those people. Oh right? no, no, Chris is a great guy. That's awesome. Yeah, he puts on a great show. We yeah. interviewed him a little earlier. Great guy, super cool, very yeah, easy to talk to. Absolutely. Very, uh, very giving. Like he's oh, like, totally. hey, this is what I got. This is what I can do. Let's yeah, it's make cool. It it's full circle. You know, he was. Um, I heard you guys give props to him. He was one of the killer. people that you know got us like on our first yeah. big tour with Otep, yeah. and that was the first time that really got us exposed to the world, and it did a lot of. Uh, cool work for us, so it's yet. cool to come back and work with him again. Uh, yeah, have we played with Seven Dust? Okay. I don't want to say we have. No, we, we haven't played with Seven Dust. I wish though. I thought, uh, Seven Dust, if you're watching, yeah, we gotta, we gotta well, make, we gotta make that happen. Yeah, LJ, manifested. let's do it. Yeah, ex yeah. yeah exactly. Oh, you know what I was work. thinking of a totally different band. I was thinking of Candle Box. I don't know why that came oh, in. Oh, my head. <laughs> Way different. I don't know why that Way. popped in my head. That's why I'm just like, what was I talking about? Wow, well, let's go back to the 90s. Yeah, yeah. So, wow. yeah, that's you can see I'm just stuck well, there. Well, yeah, that's awesome. Well, I enjoyed talking with you guys. Likewise. This has been Thanks amazing. Cool vibe, good energy. Thank you, man. Awesome show. You guys put it down. We had a blast. I'm excited to see where you guys go, especially now with Kevin at the helm. Yeah. Oh man. You guys are gonna take off. Get I can ready. feel it. Get ready. Like I said, we got some uh, we got some big plans in the works. Um, later this year we're going to Australia for the first time and uh, we're also gonna be doing ship rock so we'll be on our first wow. cruise so we're out we're 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 getting out there you know what I'm Where saying we're staying rock busy yeah Bahamas and the Florida Keys all, uh, yeah, all the ladies in the Bahamas watching this you know I'm on my way what a so. rough what a rough life <laughs> right yeah, yeah. you know <laughs> yeah. all right guys thank you so much Absolutely been pleasure, awesome brother. totally yeah. cool No cover TV. 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 No cover TV.